Alex with the hab mark. Right. Our job is to cool. attack. Let's village. go ahead and listen into Evan's brief. Yeah, briefing now. Give me like five minutes, maybe. Okay, to attack village. To attack village first, the helicopter is gonna fly on the west side of village, and it's gonna engage it. It's gonna shoot it for a little bit, and then back off and just fly around shooting shit. Assault squad is gonna take the Bradley, two MRAPs, and a striker. In formation, we'll have the two MRAPs, the two strikers, and then the Bradley. Uh, the strikers are gonna lead, and they're just gonna follow this route. Once they get to around the last five mark, they're going to suppress the shit out of village. Following them are going to be the strikers. The strikers are going to hold a squad each. They're going to run all the way up to this swamp and park at the edge of it. Um, the two um, squads and the strikers will be creeping and, and we're going to put bump. bump. Yep, creeping and bump. All their infantry are going to dismount and they're going to cross this river. They can smoke it. And all the vehicles will be suppressing. The Bradley in the back is going to hold, I believe it's going to hold Axe, right? We might have to put some of Axe guys in the MRAPs, but the Bradley is going to hold near the southern part of this road and engage anything that tries to reinforce village. Once everyone's across, all the vehicles are going to go to the, are going to go to their locations, and I've told their squad leaders, so they should have briefed you already. Um, if you are infantry, your job is to take village. You're going to clear it and just remember, guys, aggression and teamwork. Do you have any questions? Yes. Yes. What are the? Do they have any mine assets that we need to be concerned about with the vehicles? I don't Lots think so. Lots of them. They have two scouts. Fucking mines. They, they have, have scouts, scouts and they have two large shit ton of lads. there with a ton of ammo potentially. Yeah. Hey. Lots so, two scout rats, be warned if you're in a vehicle. Yeah, once we get everyone dismounted and everyone safely crossed, the vehicles are going to try to back off immediately. Okay. I have a question. Yes? Um, on the, on, on the document it said they have hats. Will they have those, uh, like, I don't know how to describe it, those other ones that are, like, more powerful? Those are It's like the tandem? The yeah, hats, yeah, the hats strikers. they have pop the Bradleys in one hit. Yeah. Be aware of that. Oh, God. That's gonna be scary. Alright. Leave the, the modders in. Yeah, Hedicool King is the one. Hedicool King is the one who's in charge of the. Or it's his mod, his helicopter mod. And we are live! We're gonna follow the helicopter because that's the newest thing. I'll get a zoom in on the, the convoy as it moves. Right off the bat, you got two MRAPs leading the way. Striker, Striker, Bradley. Chain of command. Uh, assault, creeping, axe, and bump. Oh, this thing can move. Be following the American strikers are deviating. You, it's a, it doesn't He's so high effect. up. He's... Oh, they're shooting at it with the MG. Oh, wow. Is the helicopter gonna go down this early? Oh, no. Helicopter's taking fire west side of the D leak. D leak nailing the helicopter. Alright, yeah, start heading straight south. Oh. Solid copy, solid copy. Okay, so I guess it's a good thing they didn't have a squad in there. Wow, Dealey got some great shots on him. Is the helicopter alive still? Hey, bro. I think the helicopter uh down. Maybe advise pilots hit landing to patch up. They're okay. They're okay. All right, MRAP, start engaging. Get in, get in a little close. Assault. How's it going, Mr. Uzi? MRAP, strikers, start pulling up. The, the helicopter swamp. manages to to, to get out of there. Strikers pull up to the Actually swamp. surprised. Great landing. All right, let's go ahead and watch. All right, let's go ahead and watch. What's up with that second striker? Second striker needs to move in. First striker moving in unsupported. Second striker, please. Tell, 
Creeping, tell that guy Axe. to move. Or creeping, whoever it is. What's up? What's going on? What's going on? That, that striker in the back has to move. I thought we were waiting before we push. That's not mine. Getting guys pushed up, getting ready to cross. Hopefully overwhelming their western defenses. You got blue one online. You got uh, blue three in the strikers pushing up. Blue four manning the vehicles. Only red four on that western flank. Can they overwhelm this position? They have to toss their smokes past the river because they'll just get soaked up if they toss them into the front of the river or pop, toss them on the side of the river. I think the better idea is to toss it over the window. Look at all these tracers going. It's killing frames. I love it. Get going. Get going. Land bridge right here. Here's where they're crossing. Axe Gaiman's moving. Creeping 10 seconds later. Blue 3, 10 seconds later. I like that. A, a good, good command. Axe Gaming has... Got a foothold on the west side. Not many, not many uh, people here to contest this foothold. Look at this. They're just swarming in. I like Phoenix's position. Oh no, Phoenix just went down. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, he's the pilot. Is the helicopter's down? Helicopter got shot down. Look, so the helicopter was less than effective this round. Okay. Good to know. The helicopter's not broken. It definitely has to play it safe or it's just going to get shot down super easily by those 50 cows. I was thinking, I was like, in my head, I was like, why don't they give them an AA? I feel like it's the helicopter. They, they need something to take it out. 50 cows are doing just fine. Glad I didn't see anything. Like this, but definitely just, that, the AA shreds. Nice, Pipe Funk has a fire fight with Matt Bob. Pipe Funk goes down. I'm not sure why he was trying to push and try and regain a foothold when there's a literal squad reinforcing this position. Matt Bob and Oddball keeping up the momentum. I like it. Axe Gaming's this is Axe Gaming squad, very aggressive style of command, and it's doing great. If you can keep up this momentum and just push through anything. Yeah, look at this. Look at the foothold that the US have at this point. Vehicles, not super effective so far. Not well. The thing is, I bet they've got the 50 cows that are bugged, and we can't hear them shooting. Are they shooting? No, he's he's just not shooting. The 50 cows. There's a there's an admin cam bug where you can't hear them shooting. We've seen a lot of tracers going out because they were shooting. Push across the river is the call. I like that. Get, get at least an AMRAP across the river. Okay. Where do you want yeah, see, so, look, you can't... Squad two Unfortunate. And help creeping, okay? All right, squad two and one, keep pushing. Clear the buildings. Squad two striker, I want you to push north, okay? Nope. I'm north. Assist creeping. Assault, can you get those MRAPs across? Pretty clear map? orders by Evan so far. I'm. Yeah. His comms can sometimes uh, suffer. Um, he's been working on them, and it's that's definitely improved. Almost a good frag by UJ Key onto Matt Bob here. Yeah, Matt Bob and Oddball. Get on over there. I like the aggressiveness from the US so far. It's really what's helping them get into position. What, two and one, have you found Assault's gonna move in some MRAPs from the east. I like that idea. It's really good. Negative so far. Game still is loading. Unfortunate. Jeez. Or cheers. Unfortunate. There's a helicopter drop and you miss it. Well, you didn't miss much with the helicopter out. Helicopter got shot down pretty quickly. Oh, Zeke tries to peek Senpai. No, somebody, somebody tries to. Jacko 800 tries to peek Zeke. Zeke. Goes down. It was actually really tough to see. Keep up this aggression. 13 to 10 for the U.S. They're losing people, but they're they're pushing really like 
It, it happens. You're losing people, but they're still up. So it's okay. They, they can keep losing these people. Bob takes out Zachy, keep, keep the road. 80, and one other. Hey, Update on kills. 15 Bradley kills for the U.S. to 10 kills for the insurgents. A little clumped up. The, this is straight um, IED bait right here. I'd like to see them spread out. Look at all. That's the pressure right there. Vindication goes down. Creeping goes down. Oh, three freedom fighter just... Oh, wow. That was perfect suppression. The... But at that time, somebody's got to be able to aim. Plenty of shots out. <laughs> I don't know how they didn't hit Freedom Fighter. Wait, if I join mid-game and say I join US, the next match, do I have to join INS? Yes. Whatever team you're on, you have to stay on. Senpai... Finally takes out Freedom Fighter, but Freedom Fighter got his money's worth. He had like four kills. I feel smoke. I smoke. Raj, Raj, Raj. We got fortifications down the road. To the east. I don't know how we're gonna push that. Bridge looks clear. I'm not hey, sure. Yeah, I'm on the mine. I don't know where he is. Squad one, there's a compound next to me. Okay. There he is. Oh, he only got two. Hey, I, I, I thought he got three for sure. Squad one is down the map. Okay, Salt, you can cross your MRAP over. Keep your Bradley there. Okay. Even if I join mid game and go straight to spectator, I'm not sure on the ruling exactly. I'm not an event admin, but I would assume if you, whatever team you're on, no matter what, like if you do, if you want admin. Can, oh no, he's gonna. Oh, it's a land bridge. I got scared there for a second. I was like, what is going on? I'm, I'm fairly certain um, whatever team you're on is whatever team you're on, even if like after map roll. But I'm not sure. You'd have to ask the event admin to confirm. Do you want me to go left or right? Yeah, all right, good. They actually cleared out the bridge of mines, so it's a good call. Okay, and then the strike turn right, first. There, actually. Yep. Okay. Because yeah, we're gonna get over. Get across just fine. Okay. MRAPs haven't done too much, right. specifically assaults MRAP. <laughs> Mostly, I guess he's just a command MRAP, making sure his vehicles are doing what they need to do. But on the east, meh. 20 kills for the US, 16 for the insurgents. Who do they have on the ground still? UJ Key is still up. What is this? Is that a Bradley? Rain Man and Psychonaut got flanked or are flanking. VTech goes down. Bradley's been hit twice, possibly from the roof. All right, pull the Bradley back. Pull it out. Oh, what a miss. Got it. Psychonaut goes down. They got an MRAP for their troubles, but they didn't get what they wanted, what they needed. They needed to take this out. What got them over here? There's a bike. Rain Man goes down. They got over here with a bike. Who's driving this? It's, um... Man, quick. All right, can Comrade I Aiden? Uh, Comrade Aiden and, and Best Pony. Yeah, this this map definitely loses a lot of frames. I, I go down to like 30 when I look at the city, yeah. so as long as I'm looking the other way, it's pretty okay. Right, so, let's get an uh, update on kills again. 26 for the US, 19 for the Insurgents. Who do they have on the ground? Because there's a lot of people tied up in vehicles right now. They got another? They got more? They tried to keep flanking. Wow. Is there anybody else still trying to flank? No. Doesn't look like it. Okay. They're okay. Alright, this is what you're going to do. If you can't drive it anywhere, I want the gunner to stay. And one person go... Meet up with squad three. Blackbeard. Bridge, okay. I don't know how Blackbeard got yeah, over there. We are very right now. All right. Okay. Command Bradley Blackbeard was probably uh, with the squad that was in these uh, those motorcycles on the west. One third health left on the Bradley. All right. Just keep it at a distance. All right. Copy that. How are you doing? Five insurgents left on the ground in the immediate area. 
five U.S. Six insurgents on the ground, five U.S. Plus a lot of guys tied up in vehicles. So at some point they're gonna have to get out. They're, they're barely up on guys, and they still gotta clear some buildings. Man, you want me to come in there with you now? Uh, no, you stay there. Just pick off any. Is the most successful push that I've seen from this off? Yeah, the aggression from Evan's squad to get on those. Can't even go to admin or show the map anymore. Look how many admin cams are there. Really wish I could take get rid of that. Wow, turtle guy is. Who's hunting who? Do they even know either is here? The most unsuccessful I've seen done in Operation Grinder in the second round. That round was so fast. Yeah, Operation Grinder is definitely a quick off. Alright, there's a guy in the compound directly east of me, so watch out. I went no shot to Striker. Yeah, yeah. Directly one six. Alright, they're all over there. Just put one in there if you have it. Which one? So Turtle's got the flank on these guys. I really want to have him in frame, but he's not exactly on the flank. Once they start shooting, yeah, I guess this is actually. Cross the river and come up behind them, okay? Because they're not gonna peek anything. Uh, can you repeat? Yeah, Turtle's actually gonna come come up on uh, Patrick Star, I believe. Okay. Yeah, nobody's looking. Nobody's looking. Uh, no, so you're gonna stay there. The Bradley Patrick Star is. Nope. Hurdle's not looking the right way either. He runs the exact opposite direction. He needs to. Squad one and three just holding a compound. One and three just holding a compound. That's uh, this group of guys. Game plan. Striker and Bradley are gonna cross the river northeast. Once they get a flank on village and shoot shit, squad one and three are gonna move. Okay. And then assault. You can do it. You can just drive around and harass. Okay. Copy all. All right, so we're gonna wait for Striker and Bradley. I like that. That was actually really good. It's you, you have these sometimes. It, it's sort of like the end game brief. It's where you're like, all right, everybody, we're stop shooting, stop shooting, stop shooting, stop shooting. Let's get let's let's figure out what's going on with our lives. What do we have left? What can we do with what we've got left? Here's what we're going to do with what we can, we have left. All of this has to go through Evan's head in about a minute. This should all take him about, you know, 30 seconds to a minute. And he should figure out what he's got left, what he's going to do with what he's got left. Then the next 30 seconds is briefing his guys. And then he's got, you know, two minutes to get it going. So it's a lot of pressure on Evan to uh, to do things. And this is all hoping that nobody tries to do anything crazy like Alpha Guido pushing Dash B. Alpha Guido goes down. <laughs> I'm going to try to get the knife on, the, the disrespect knife, and it paid. Does he still have the knife in hand? He does, look. He dropped his knife. Yeah. Uh, I was, uh, I was feeling that. He got, he got one. Looks like there were five here, I believe. There were five there. It looks like they have a two on the balcony facing east at Charlie 752. Turtle shoots a dash B. And he moves. That's it. Fire maneuver. I guess you're leaving. There. Waiting right. for the chase. He's expecting the chase. Don't do it, Patrick Star. He's baiting you. Yeah, map I've read him like a book. We should just we should push. We should push. Push. He's back in the compound. Tracker cross the river, and you're gonna. Alpha died. Yeah, Alpha died. And just shoot everything. Alpha died trying to knife Dash B, um, and then Turtle ended up getting Dash B, and then hiding. I'm expecting them to run over these mines. No, he's gonna go completely around. Okay. Probably for the best. Who do they, they? There's still plenty of insurgents left. Update on kills: 28 for the U.S., 23 for the insurgents. Still five guys here, and there and only three U.S. remaining. Yeah. You don't have to go exactly near them. Just get on the south side of village and shoot. Okay. So I noticed dust and stuff being kicked up on the, the sides of the building. Look, I, I assume he's been firing the whole time. Um, looks like he's out of ammo, actually. No, he's still got ammo. Um, 
Yeah, I assume he's been shooting for a while. Unfortunately, we cannot hear. Assault is a squad lead to get these guys. The assault crits goes down. Patrick Star go down, and the other go down. How did what? We just got assault this town. Okay, I'm not sure. I guess. That's all right. Just chill in admin camp. No, you're fine. Just stay. Just don't say anything. All right, striker. I want you to push the town with assaults M wrap. Okay. Copy. Just, just. Twenty-eight to twenty-six. And certain bring it back. It's said vehicle advantage that they had allowed them to get the foothold, but it's not allowing them to exploit said foothold because they didn't want, really want to commit any of their vehicles close. Do our best. And I think that's what they're they're paying for. Well, wow, Blackbeard must have had a really nice flank there. Six people left, still for the U.S. A lot of rifles. Five left for the insurgents. Actually, six left for the insurgents. Seven. I am not sure. They're all over the place. Infantry in the compound directly at 285 from my position. Yeah, just rush everything. Just get in buildings and try to kill people. I can just window to your right. Go around. Got it. Jumping up the window. There is enemy infantry, the compound in the middle. That's two story. Jake, he's shooting at Evan SMA. Evan SMA goes down a turtle, I believe. Yeah, I don't know why I got on the roof. Bad call. Yeah. Gonna have to get out of the vehicles. It's to that point. Yeah. Look, you see, we can hear the ricochets. You just can't hear it shooting. Blackbeard's gonna flank Gerwolf from the soul too. Oh no. Be quickly. Gerwolf goes down to uh, I Money's, I believe. A soul gets the counter frag. Can you get one more? Don't don't try and nade this. Okay. I don't, I don't know. What's the call? What's the call? Oh, assault goes down. Tra almost treasures I money. I money's gonna bandage. He'll be okay. Only four guys remaining are in vehicles. They're gonna have to get out of here soon. Other than that, one, six left, five left for the insurgents. Still. Guys in the striker can jump out and uh, try to assault it also. Yeah, let's do it. Let's assault it. Only three guys remaining. Yeah, you're gonna have to get out. Three versus five, I believe. Okay. Bolts. Shit. Where? There's one inside. Or UJP. Northeast, 60 degrees off my pause. I'm gonna frag him. Hold on. Just gotta bandage. 
Sneaky spot. Shit, I don't have a frag. That's right, I'm a crewman. Okay, just hold that window. Frag, frag, frag. Go. Too far. Bartok, he's just to the left around the next corner. Nobody in there, Bartok. I think he's on that there. Yeah, he's on the stairs. Copy. You get him? No. Oh, pony goes oh, down to so Blackbeard's I flank. Uh, I have an idea. Just hold there. Pony's down. I like the idea. It's just the other flank is not clear. We've got an okay crossfire. And you, Jake, he's about to move. Doesn't even matter. Oh, took that shot. The karma? No, I'm on ace. JK takes out Stalker Della Note. So, the aggression from the US was great to start it off. They, uh, they managed to get a foothold on the west here. They had a lot of pressure. They managed to get three full squads almost across. They just couldn't follow yeah. through was the call. Get vehicles in there and help push. Get the guys out of vehicles and have them help push that way, just having more manpower, or have the vehicles swing from another flank and then try and draw some pressure on that area, potentially allowing a stronger hold from the west. A couple different ways that could have played out. Unfortunate for them, they just couldn't. Uh, it, it, it came down to that CQB and they just couldn't follow through, get those kills. 29 to 32. It, re it came down to it um, about eight or five left for the insurgents. But uh, in the end, they managed to hold out. I'm gonna go ahead and swap. We'll break him in. All right, really clear. Um, man brief. Let's see if that translates into his platoon brief. Karma sounds excited. He gets to use the helicopter, Mr. Uzi, or at least has the scouting potential of the helicopter. I guess they can't use it as a trans truck, trans helicopter. It's strictly for scouting and uh, machine gun fire from one of the flanks. Other way, other way, other way. Let's try to see. It's situated for the platoon brief. I'll go ahead and drop this map. You can't really get much more information out of it. The circle, they have to move to here. They gotta assault uh, village. Oh, let's go over assets for the insurgents so you know what they've got to work with and wh what they have to be so careful about because there's a lot. Um, the insurgents get one squad lead, two fire team leads, or one squad lead, two fire team leads, two automatic riflemen, two light anti tank kits, and one medic per squad. The platoon armory is two extra hats okay, and two extra scouts. Job. They also get a lot of vehicles: two Dishka techies, one SPG techie, Welcome, three Lodgy techies, this and four trans techies. Against a, uh, insurgent defense, the insurgents have held up in the town located on the five marker in Charlie Seven Five Eight. They've placed a radio jammer that is interfering with our airfield operations in the north. Our objective as a platoon is to insert into the village, just find and destroy the enemy jammer. Note that it has been reported there is only one squad at that location. The remaining insurgent forces will be reinforcing from the southeast of the city. Our plan is to stack as a vehicle convoy. Leading the convoy will be uh, BVD runner in the Bradley. Followed by BVD runner will be nope, money nope, man. Nope, nope, in... nope. Oh, uh, not, not in the Bradley. Bradley. Alpha. Alpha will be in the Bradley in the front. Followed by Alpha in, in the Bradley in the front will be uh, Money Man in a Striker. Followed by Money Man Striker is Foo Striker. And finally in the rear is BVD Runner with both open top MRAPs. Overhead, we will have Aerial Recon support with one times Blackhawk. We are now marking the stops along our path. We are booking it off live to the first bridge marked with the FOB marker. On that five marker is stop one. Followed south of stop one is south two, and southwest of stop two is stop three. So in order, it's stop one, two, and three, moving from the north to the southwest. We're moving as a platoon to the first stop. Once we get to the first stop, the only squad stopping there will be the MRAP squad, uh, which is BVD Runner. All, the rest of the convoy will be proceeding to stop two. At stop two, Fu and Money Man will be dismounting and securing stop two, leaving the Bradley which is Alpha Guido squad to continue to stop three, which is very specifically on the five marker. Um, that very specifically the five mark building. The four mark building is 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 not a good building. Um, the intent here between our entire platoon movement in the first initial starts of this operation are to choke off the enemy force in the village. 
we are going to be cordoning off the village and securing a perimeter. Vehicles will be looking east and south for enemy reinforcements. Infantry will only be engaging the village if we are taking fire. If we have not taken fire, infantry is to also secure the cordon on the east and south. We are only returning fire and looking in towards the village if we are taking fire or uh, indirect fire from that village itself. Overhead will be recon support telling us where enemy reinforcements are. The intent of this is to get the insurgent reinforcements coming from the southeast to divert to the northwest or far west. Once it has been determined that the enemy reinforcements have been diverted away from the village, we will then commit all three infantry squads, scratch, all four infantry uh, elements in each squad to commit on the village, leaving a four to one advantage uh, for infantry to clear through the town. If it has been decided that the enemy uh, reinforcements are going to attempt to push through the cordon, we are going to ignore the village and all guns will, will be focused on enemy reinforcements coming from the southeast. So once again, the general overlying theme of this is punch through and break through the center. Contain a perimeter. Uh, maintain control over the east and south with vehicle support. Once it has been de determined whether the enemy is either A, flanking around our cordon, then we will push in or B, committing to the cordon, then we will hold and engage the enemy in the open. Are there any questions at this time? Uh, yeah, one question. Is... Shoot. Does the, uh, this convoy, does it break up along the way? So when BBD drops off, we lose the MRAPs at that uh, yes. checkpoint? Okay. Hey, yes. Bro. At stop is one, Bradley... two, and three, respectively. Is Bradley stopping at stop two while they dismount, or are we blitzing it to three? No. Bradley will go all the way to their stop rate um, unless yeah. you get too Bradley. far apart. I, don't, I want Guys. them being somewhat, you know, don't blitz ahead of the convoy when we're in transit. Stay in tune Obviously. with the uh, convoy. Yeah. This, these dismounts will be handled vehicles, vehicles, individually so by the squads. Yeah, so you're just going to see squads fall off the back of the convoy. Yeah, so, so my squad will not be like, well, my squad stops first, but the other squads will not be waiting while we dismount and take our positions. They're just pushing right, right through, right through. It's Speed. important to note that as soon as we, we, we find that the enemy has diverted reinforcements, that all infantry elements uh, commit to the town aggressively because that is when the t uh, timer starts between their flank and getting to the point and our rush to take out the objective, okay? I know it's going to seem scary out there. You're going to want to slow down and take it slow, but remember you have a 4-1 to advantage. If you push it hard and fast enough, you should be able to blitz and obliterate the defense. Yeah, boy. Aggression is key on that note. Uh, so it's either aggression or we're holding them off in the open. All right, go ahead and break them out, squad leads. Finish up your briefing. Pilots, let's get ready to go. So, for those of you just joining us, Commerce Plan, in a nutshell, get a envelopment on Village from three spots here, here, and here. Here, here, and here. And then they're going to push in with vehicles. Like that. Cut out any vehicles. We're live. You to the city, you are free to pull MRAPs in. All other optic vehicles remain on perimeter. Copy that. Okay. He's gonna. Oh, to to look how far the, away he's gonna uh, command to from. Go the Bradley. the Bradley's gonna slow us down too much. INS on the move. Let's go watch INS. We know what the helicopter is gonna do. And let's check out disc placement. Heavy on the discus. They they won AA. It's it's 100% easy to say AA now. Negative. Okay, we'll hold. Wow, they're already shooting at it. I don't think you're going to be able to command from the, the helicopter karma. Not with the pressure that these discus can put out. The easier it is for the discus to fire. I'm not sure. Make an eyes option right, Mr. Easy. Can INS resupply ammo? INS can. Actually, they, they, they are reinforcing. So two of the Lodgies started here already. They can reinforce with one Lodgie. Let me check if they can run, if they can actually run logistics. May not run logistics. So the ammo they've got is the ammo they've got. 
Blue 4 reaches their staging, no problem. <gasps> SPG's right underneath it! Oh, disc is firing already. Armor shooting back. Oh no. Oh no. The helicopter going down? I think they're okay. Alright, left side, I'm switching left side. Stop two secure! We have a report of a techie moving south. Find that techie moving south, e Pink. Copy. Um Southwest moving south for our position. Yeah, Bradley's engaged with that techie. It's in the It's direct, D7. it's running straight towards the Bradley. The Delta 773 location, it's moving south towards the plane. Bradley's engaged. And Dishki Techie. Oh look at Bradley's that! So, stop one, secure. Easy peasy. Stop two, secure. Easy peasy. Stop three, caused them a little more trouble. They got engaged by two discos, or, or excuse me, two techies. But they've got the, uh, the Bradley, and that'll uh, right, do just fine. I don't know how the helicopter's still alive. You can zoom. I can zoom, yes. Still in there, Gandalf takes out two Boogie and Dark Milkshake. Oh. Zaki, King Sam, and Fish God finish out that other flank. Okay. Alright, they managed to do, uh, they managed to get a foothold on three. This probably costs them the most. Um, what's the call here? I think push in from the, the, the this west. This is now just a flank holding squad. Most of the, the red team got into and is securing the village. Going for a really strong northern defense, leaving their southeast open. This building's going to be a key hold for the insurgents. We'll see what happens. Listen to that. Listen to that shoot. The last, Bradley last round definitely didn't shoot this much. I'm almost 100%. One already down to that. Push six kills for the U.S., two right. kills for the insurgents. Up on this wall, guys. Let's go check out other mortars. Wow, they they really want these guys in the southwest. Or excuse me, yeah. Well, I guess it's it's southeast of them, southwest of the U.S. push. Look at this. They're gonna use the strikers as shields, and they're gonna move. I like it. Good job, Fu. This is Fu. Look at it firing. It's getting into position. It knows it's it's. Pretty, it's a pretty hefty, hefty vehicle. It can take a couple shots to the front, and it's just gonna move. Fire and move, allow the rest of the platoon to move behind it. I like it. Across the road. All right, you ready? They're having to talk over the MGs. Just imagine the pew 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 of the, a bunch of 50 cows going off. Really good and consistent movement by Blue One. MRAP squad still hasn't pushed yet. They need to get going. I'm not seeing them fire either. The only way to tell this one this one was I, I definitely saw yeah. So see there's is shooting. Fu, you are now uh, direct control over the assault. Money man, I want your striker looking eastbound towards city over. I got a copy. Striker watch east. Copy. What's the what's the helicopter doing? It's playing with the other techie essentially. Yeah, yeah. Strikers, they are to the east. I need help. My Bradley needs help. Copy, Quito. Copy. My striker is down to 90 rounds. Squad three, if your striker gets more, it would be appreciated. Oh no, it's that the that SPG. Assault SPG. Nice. Nice angle. I thought Assault was focusing on that MRAP, or excuse me, the helicopter, but no. He wanted the Bradley. Good focus. Probably gonna end up taking this out. 
Yeah, I need to go head over here and check this out. You don't know how to bulldog, right? Bulldog is definitely way beef. If you're looking at assault, firing onto the SPG, they may be spotted here. Keep moving. The longer you sit in one position, that mortar fire is going to hit you. Be advised, I only got hit with hat. Uh, we are... So where did the INS push to get into the village? I missed that. I believe they pushed in from the direct south. It's relatively easy to get in here re quickly. And uh, with the roundabout way they, they took. Ooh, Pony's the one aiming uh, this. Bradley, Bradley, this is man. I want you mounting up and rejoining the rest of the platoon right on top of three. How copy two, over. Oh, Pony, are you going to do it? To Guido, Guido, I'm ready, up. Pony. Say again, command. He's not. Okay. Guido, I want you. I want you to break that south flank and move to support on the east. Man, Look at him. He's tempted. To the east. My striker is out of ammo. Roger that. We're using his armor transport. Solid copy one. Oh, so close, Pony. But that MG fire is just gonna suppress the. Uh, it's gonna be hard. It's hard to get accurate. They can get. It's it's really hard to get accurate with that MG. I was trying to fire it uh, before the round started. Oh, when he tries again, misses. Garrett had to bandage. He'll be okay. Let's go check out the assault. Really good, really good dismount here. If this was a full squad, this would have been even better. Don't get too close, don't get too close. Right here's good, right here's good. Yeah, there you go. I, I'm talking to them like they can hear me, they can't. Yeah, probably further back, and uh, this would be just great positioning. Like, semi, it's aggressive enough. There's aggressive, and then there's like stupid aggressive. There's like aggressive, and then there's like suicidal. Th that would have been the right amount of aggressive, I think. Um, draw a lot of fire, allow UJ Key, Mr. Wilbur, and Max to push in. Here's probably, it's this, this is the safe aggressive. Oh, he's just, he's ferrying them up. He doesn't want guys to go down, cross in open grounds. Okay. Alright. <laughs> that's, that's hyper safe right there. This helicopter still alive. We gotta keep tabs on the helicopter. Helicopter's still alive. Right here. Dismount him here. Yes. This is a, an armored in infantry support vehicle or infantry fighting vehicle, whatever they're called. Troop transport. This is how you use them. And he gets him right outside. Right side of the door. Trident already knows where to look. Oh no, Trident, you knew where to look and you, you lost focus. Vladimir Putin's going to take out. Okay. They got him eventually. That's what happens. Sometimes you lose out. Frost misses a shot. Gives away Mr. Enemy Man. APA going to try and take out Frost. Almost. Almost. Oh no, he's going to toss a frag. This might take out three. Liberal Pundit's going to go down here. No, he didn't toss it at the right angle. I like the use of the vehicles. This is how you, this is how to be aggressive with the vehicles and get a foothold. Really nice. On the south, look at that. Look at this push on the south. Who is this? This is two? Alpha Guido squad made something happen on the south. This is that building. I said this is the building they left open. And this is why they shouldn't have left it open. Great foothold. Down. Yeah, this is a great building for them to hold. Do you still to hold because they don't need to go anywhere. They got, they can see everything to the north. Everything. They're in a, an amazing building. Zeke's going to try and push a refurbished one in Beef Baby. 
Oddball on the M or excuse me, yeah. Oddball or MNSMA on the uh, mortar. Deek sees him though. Mortars aren't gonna do anything. They're shuttling people with uh, with vehicles. Are they chasing that? They are chasing the Bradley with mortars. What is this? Wow. Uber Oscar Mike. <laughs> good for good suppression from Karma on the run. Yeah. How's, how's the helicopter? Where's the helicopter? Is it dead? No. Okay. It's just Phoenix and e -Fink now. Karma decided to get on the ground. And I'm not sure where he went. Mortars. Look at this foothold. This is... IED bait. Look, there's Karma Cut. He makes it with his platoon. There's mortars on the Bradley, right? Bradley is down. Repeat, Bradley's down. RPG came from the roof with West. Get this infantry across this fucking road. Yeah. Watch your spacing. Watch the spacing. Smoke, smoke, smoke. You got smoke. Do you see my tracers? The enemy tech team direct on tracer. Now, what the fuck? Not like that. Not a bit like that. Hey, if anyone needs a ammo bag, I'm dropping ram. As soon as he smoke fell up, next cop out. Copy. Copy. Next cop. Are you doing? You got your guys here. Wait, don't smoke. Let's breach the cop out. Yeah, let's. I'm gonna take the north side. Charlie, I'll be in north. They lost their vehicles really quickly. Re uh, was that an, uh, that might have been Stalker who got that kill. But uh, I see one vehicle, two vehicle. Three vehicles. They got a striker alive. Three, four vehicles. They've lost a majority of their vehicles. But they've got... They look at the kills. 26 kills for the US, 15 for the insurgents. They've got the man advantage, and this is sort of where it matters, I think, because the vehicles are going to be the vehicles are getting less and less useful. Copy four, three. Organize your Yeah, the 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 vehicles went down in very quick succession. Look, helicopter just. <laughs> what? What? I don't know how. I don't. I don't know how that happened. I. I it just sort of. I, I think that it lost. It probably lost engine power getting shot by something. Um. But all I saw it was just flip on my screen. So let's check out the situation as it lies. U.S. have a very strong foothold to uh, push through, but one good IED could swing it in their favor. Patrick Starr takes out Karma Cut. Karma Cut's in the front because that's Karma Cut. Um, it loses him. Maybe he, he might have hit the water tower. Um, insurgents are surrounded or surrounding the U.S., but not by many. They've got. I knew they had a a techie crew on the outside, like Both Pony and two others. Both disco techies are down, but where's the SPG techie? I see Frost alive. Patrick Starr's alive. Two. Three, four. Five with Dashby. That's five with Dashby. And uh, let's check out Blue. Oh, if that idea had been a slightly... Maybe almost. IED just went off north of us. I don't think we took any casualties. Yeah, I'll tell you now. I am going to sneeze on him dead. Alright, we can organize one of those guys. Well, where is he? Squad 4, I want you to continue circling. At least 11 U.S. Clear the north side of town and then push southwest. I got it. The striker does have ammo. What do you want with it? Where do you want me to direct you? 2, I want you to move that striker to the north side center of town and suppress central building. 
Copy that. Right, head to the north side of town to press central buildings. North side of town to press central buildings. Not that far north. Look, Clef, look, stop. Hold, hold, hold. Reverse, reverse. Yeah, back in, back in. Hold. Enemy is in the blue shipping container, uh, right south right of the strike. They're saying blue shipping container. Enemy is in that blue shipping container. Roger, Copy. roger. God, I so wish you could hear the MG. That just bugs me. Pilot got shot out? Okay. That actually makes sense. The pilot probably got shot out. Good suppression by the, uh, the... Striker. Making sure Patrick Star's not gonna want to peek out of there. But is it worth it? For, for one guy. Patrick Star makes it out of there. Yeah, is it worth the ammo for the one guy? Roger, copy. I'm all alone down here, guys. I think they're on my position on the south side. Copy, do you hear an enemy radio at your position, too? 50 should be able to penetrate that container. I, I think, yeah, I, I think it should. And uh, maybe he just didn't know about it. Kingston Fish God goes down to Stalker Della Note. Stalker Della Note goes, I guess, he, I guess he trades. Update on kills, 29 for the U.S., 25 for the insurgents. Yeah, they were shooting at the door. They weren't like spreading out the fire. I don't think where he was standing, he would have had the angle. Cause look, see, see where the wall is. He was standing in the back part of the container, so I don't think it would have mattered. But I, but he, he was 100% just shooting at the door rather than like up and down the container. Like back here, he would, he would be able to fit back there and not have to worry about getting shot. No medics. No medics. Looks like. Like, why is he so I low health? Five grenades hey, uh, left. Looks like they yeah. How many grenades? Five. Copy that. We're gonna use them, okay? The grenadier. That's Copy. why he has so many. Not actual frag grenades. Hey, right. Max, step on this corner this time, okay? This corner. Orient yourself towards that uh, striker. Same thing. Mister, you're with me. Let's go. Got it. Good fire team leading. Yeah, it's fine. Mister, watch my uh, self. Got. Oh no! <laughs> they get smoked across. Our money's taking advantage of it. The little victories. Compound is clear. Compound is clear. All right, Max. Same thing. Set up on that corner over here. Walk my fire team gets set up. Sold here for yeah. a bit. I think I might have one to my east. I think I hear him moving around. Copy that. The nail biter. This one. Thor pushes Patrick Star. Patrick Star, none the wiser. Copy. All right, let's take a look. Where are the where are the insurgents? Are they got Evan SMA over there. That's one dash B two. No, that's Uzi it. three. That's it. Leaves one two seven US versus three INS. US might have this, but the INS are just spread out enough to where they 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 still have to take a slow for every Careful, single building. Ready. My guy's gonna hold that position and try to suppress the building when we push. Copy that. I'll put some smoke out for our cross. Fuck. All right. Copy. Hold one. Hold one. Save smoke from. Let's just breach the east side, and we're gonna take this compound. Roger.
Alright, on me, on me. Mista, with me, with me. Get your GL out. We're gonna start nailing these fucking windows. Oh, you reload. That's fine. I'm out. Alright, you gotta use a staircase. You gotta start lobbing grenades in those windows and doors. First floor and second, okay? Use a staircase. Amino's, we're gonna fucking push, okay? One upstairs, I'm gonna one downstairs. Sure. Can I have that pop? Just spray them out. And Minos, come with me. Three left. I like the the uh, the way they're clearing out this building. They're using the assets they've got. They know they're under moon. They know they're not a full platoon, and uh, better to use it and not and not die with it. That's the worst thing. Is like. Some people are like, I don't know when I'm not, like, it's a one life event. I got to use it at the right time to get the maximum effectiveness. You got to use it before you, you know, you die. Then if you die you, using it, then or without using it, then nothing happened. They just got some awkward position. They're holding Uzi, chilling out. Oh no, Dash be giving away the position. I'm looking. Such sneaky position. Dash be actually gonna pull off the build the the roof. Let's see if seating that angle is gonna gonna hurt them or help or, or help them. Uzi is gonna be pretty difficult to find. I believe he's gonna get at least one. If he can land his shots, he's gonna get at least two kills before uh, they recognize where he is, or he's forced out. Forced out. Second floor already clear up here. I think not an NSA spy went down, yeah. Not an NSA spy went down to Dashby. UJ keep missing his shots. Nope, lands him. No, no, not UJ Key. Uzi missing his shots onto UJ Key. Eventually lands him. Probably, yeah. Uzi forced to move. Who's he gonna try and push Thor? Thor wasn't looking. Goes down to CJ Fu. That's just what an NSA spy would say. They lost like so many people in that engagement. Down to four versus two. Ines making them pay for it. They only lost two, right? They, they might have lost three. I think they lost three. Dashby needs to, to fall back now. At least try and hold a cross angle with Evan. If not, Evan's just going to be forced to hold this on his own. And he can probably do it. Well, Fu's not the... the who is aggressive? He's not the least aggressive person out there, so I think he'll get it done. Dashby needs to move if he wants to be of any use. So I think I've recovered from that striker striker death to a mine. I didn't. 
Yeah. We're gonna go down and we're down right here. Last vehicle alive. Ripped over a mine. Comet. We're gonna check the western compound first. Then we're gonna move. I'm gonna push I'm gonna through watch here. Six. Copy, Max, you're on me. Let's go. Clear left and right, clear left. They found the radio yet? No, they have not. They're checking this western building and they said they're gonna start moving east. Clear. Okay, this is clear. There's no radio in audible range. Left is in the extreme western edge of the compound. It's not here. Oh, Mr. Wilbur goes down to Dashby. Sneaky, sneaky. Look at that. Wow. No. Oh, no. There he goes. Dashby goes down. Burned his position for one kill. Needed to get two. All right. I money's Max CJ Foo, CG Foo versus Evan. Can he do it? He, he, like, wow, look at, okay, let's take a look at his little madhouse he's got. What does he got when you come in? Anything on the first floor? Nothing. Easy, easy, uh, entry. What's he got on the second? Okay. That was a probably an awkward barbed wire. The barbed wire, not gonna be able to peek, it, peek the angle safely. Gotta make it super wide. Oh, yeah. He can hold out in here. He can get three kills in here if the, he doesn't get grenaded to death. You hear anything? I don't hear any radio. Most there, foo. We'll get it. The second floor access on this side. Three v one. Uh, yeah, three v one. Evan SMA pushing out of his building. Don't do it. They gotta come to you. Evan's getting back on the mortar. You know, this might have been the giveaway that there is some. This is where the mortar is. Feeling it. Mortar. Enemy east. Gives away his position, though. There's a murder hole here. Oh no, he's gonna get killed by the murder hole. Can I jump up? I don't. I don't. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> That's the way he goes down because he thought the sandbag was dug all the way up. Imagine if this mortar had gotten these kills. Imagine that. That would have been amazing. They did it though. <laughs> nice try, Evan. And US win it this time. Helicopter? What do y'all think of the what do you what did y'all think of it this round? I don't think it could have I don't think it was super effective. Great job to both uh, platoons, though, using their uh, their other assets, their ground vehicles, pretty effectively. It came down to the CQB. Um, the U.S. had it this round. The U.S. had it last round. It, 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 it com Yeah, it, it comes down to that CQB and how well you can execute. But uh, great job. Or if, if you want to participate in these events, check out squadups.gg. All you have to do is sign up on the website, take our basic training course, only about 45 minutes to an hour long. Then you can participate on any and all of our Squad Ops One Life events. We host them on Wednesdays, twice on Saturdays, and uh, we have our Friday and Sunday events. I'm not sure if those are every week, but uh, they are definitely a lot of fun, and we encourage you to participate on as many as you want. Um, I was your commentator for this evening, Shadowed Ritual, and until next time, we will catch you later.